The Robert Kikala Fellowship was created to carry on the legacy of Island News former managing editor Robert Kikala. Now, selected as the first fellow, Kaylee Pascal Martinez. She's here in studio to talk about her experience as our very first fellow. So, Kaylee, why, why did you decide to take on this fellowship and what is it all about? So my mom was actually the one who forwarded me the application to the fellowship and she thought it would be a great opportunity for me and it was, so thank you mom. And knowing that I was the first is super special because it's in honor of Robert and he was such an amazing man and journalist. And I know that whoever gets this um, opportunity to be a part of this fellowship will experience what it's like to be in the newsroom and being in broadcast and really witness what goes into making what we see on screen. So you've spent a lot of time in the newsroom. What have you learned and what have you enjoyed? Wow, that's really hard because I've enjoyed so much. I've experienced so much. I've gotten to be in every department from engineering, from sales, in the newsroom, of course, and getting to be on the field with others. And I think the most meaningful thing that I've learned is that everyone has a significant role you know, in playing what we see on screen every day. And so what did you enjoy the most? Because I know that you're helping us yeah. with digital. Yeah, I love being in digital, but um, being a part of going out with MMJs like on the field yeah. has been super cool, super fun. I've gotten to meet so many different people and interview different people. It's been so much fun. So when you first applied, did you think you are going to be the first fellow? No, I didn't, because I didn't know how many other people applied, and I was like, you know, I'm going to just shoot my shot, and I'm so glad that I got it. Okay, and so what do you hope to accomplish with, after being a fellow? What are your aspirations? I hope to continue my journey with journalism and continue to share people's stories who may not be able to, and I love making that connection with others and really trying to make an impact with um, media. And so when you've learned and gone through the various departments, what do you think that others who may be watching now could learn and, and go away with? What well, kind of skills? Yeah, I would say if they have a passion for storytelling in any way and they're looking for a way to get their foot in the door, this would be the perfect opportunity to do so because you get to experience everything in the news station. And if you don't know which avenue you want to go to yet, that's okay because there's so many different options. So what do you like in terms of being a journalist? What do you like the most? And for others who may want to also be a journalist, what have you picked up from being in the newsroom? Um, just the story, making that impact, making that connection with others through just listening to their story and being able to share it with others. Um, like I said, if you ha if they have a passion for storytelling and they want to make an impact with others in the community, this would be the great opportunity for them. And so the fellowship also offers you a you know, part-time gig. Mm -hmm. You get paid. Yeah. So tell us yes. about that. Yes. So it's a paid part-time year-long position, and it's for current local college students who are in interested in journalism or currently pursuing a career in journalism and it's been it's so awesome i can't even stress it enough this is a great opportunity for storytellers and so how would someone who is watching out there now apply so they can apply online and i believe they have to do a short essay and the deadline to apply is friday march 1st and the fellowship will begin monday march 20th and so for others watching, what can you say to encourage them as far as like, yes, go ahead, try out? Yeah. No, yes, you should totally apply. If, I, like I said, if you have a passion for storytelling, this is for you. And at the, at the beginning of my fellowship, I didn't really know what broadcast entails, but here I am now a part of the team. So just be yourself, come ready to learn, and have fun. And if you want to apply for the Robert Kekala Fellowship application to do by March 1st, and the student must be interested in broadcast journalism. And we will, of course, have all that information online at KITV.com. Thank you so much. Thank you. Stay with you.